In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to draw a rectangle with specific or exact dimensions in AutoCAD. This task, while seemingly simple, is fundamental to your success in creating precise designs and blueprints. First, you'll need to open up your AutoCAD software and get everything ready to go. Once you have opened your project or a new drawing, you'll start by typing the word rectangle or simply rect right into the command line at the bottom of your screen. This is one of the core commands in AutoCAD for creating rectangular shapes and is essential for ensuring precision in your designs. Once you have typed that in, go ahead and press Enter. You'll notice your cursor changes to indicate the software is ready for you to place your rectangle. Now, it's time to determine where you want this rectangle to begin. Using your mouse, click a point on the screen that you'll use as your base point. This is essentially the corner of your rectangle. Choosing the right base point is important as it serves as your reference throughout the drawing process. Next, to streamline your workflow and make it easier to modify the dimensions, you'll want to enable dynamic input. Simply press F12 on your keyboard and you should see your cursor area displaying additional information. Dynamic input allows you to enter dimensions and navigate through options directly at the cursor, making it a powerful tool for real-time adjustments. After enabling dynamic input, you can start entering the exact dimensions you need for your rectangle. Your command line will guide you by prompting the need for specific values. You'll first enter one dimension, either the width or the height of your rectangle. Be deliberate with this step to ensure you're working with the measurements right for your task. After entering the first dimension, press the tab key to switch between entering the width and height. You have the flexibility here to adjust each dimension accordingly. Make sure you press enter once you've set both dimensions to lock those values in. This process ensures accuracy, letting you precisely control the size and scale of your rectangle to suit your project needs. Ultimately, drawing a rectangle with specific dimensions in AutoCAD is straightforward, but requires attention to detail. Mastering these steps will give you the confidence to plan and execute your designs efficiently and accurately. That wraps up our quick guide on how to draw rectangles with specific dimensions in AutoCAD. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and that it makes your future TAD projects smoother and more accurate. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out other videos in our series for more helpful tips and tricks in AutoCAD.